Every year, the Global Carbon Project publishes data on carbon dioxide emissions from fossil fuels. Emissions must rapidly fall towards zero to reduce the risk of dangerous climate change. The United States is the world's second largest emitter. In 2017, its emissions are projected to fall 0.4%, a smaller reduction than the previous decade. In Japan, the sixth largest emitter, emissions have been falling recently. In the world's largest emitter, China, this year emissions are expected to grow by over 3% after falling for two years. Coal consumption is on the up, even with China's rapid expansion of renewables. In India, the fourth largest emitter, emissions have grown about 6% per year in the last decade, but are expected to grow only 2% in 2017. This slowdown may be short-lived only. Emissions have been declining in Russia, the fifth largest emitter in recent years. Emissions decreased in the last decade in Europe, the third largest emitter, but it remained stable in recent years. Declines in coal use have been offset by gains in oil and gas consumption. Across Africa, countries are developing fast and emissions are slowly growing from a low baseline. In South America, emissions could be beginning to fall. Australia is among the top emitters per capita. The gradual decline in Australian emissions has reversed in the last three years. Globally, after nearly no growth for three years, emissions are expected to grow 2% in 2017. This is very concerning. Stronger policies are required to ensure emissions peak and fall rapidly. For a decade, emissions in 22 countries have fallen while their economies keep growing. These positive trends need to intensify and spread quickly for the world to reach net zero emissions around 2050.